So earlier today it was raining and I decided now was the time to come out seeing as the sun's literally just come out um, and I'm going to go down to the lakes and see if I can get some good shots and go through the forests and see if I can get some nice tree shots for you uh, and I'll explain to you what I'm doing at the time so let's get into this. Right, so the first thing is I thought I'd bring you here because this is a little spot I found um, a couple of days ago. Now I've been living around this area for quite a few years to be honest with you um, and I never knew this existed. Um, I was out with, walking with a friend of mine taking a few um, pictures of the trees and the forests and uh, literally just stumbled across this and just look at the view. It's actually stunning. Um, yeah, it's a little lake that's hidden away behind loads of trees. It doesn't look like there's anyone comes down here. I did try to go around it, but unfortunately, it uh, seems to be blocked off a bit around the, around the sides, uh, which is a bit of a shame, because it looks quite nice. Um, so I'd like to have walked around it, see what angles I could get, but unfortunately, this is the only angle I got. But saying unfortunate, it's quite a good, um, good angle, and um, hopefully I'll get some good shots from it. So um, we're in a spot now where I've been many times before and every time I come here it's, um, it's different. The light conditions are always different and, and you see things slightly differently than you did before. So um, in a moment I'll show you, I'll turn the camera around and you'll see what the light's doing. Um, but because it's been raining, all the greens kind of stand out, it's more vibrant, more colour and, and it's absolutely fantastic. Um, I love coming here. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the camera around and I'll tell you I, um, I'm going to keep the ISO quite low on the, these shots um, just to keep the clarity and uh, all the colours so you can hear the birds in the background. It's, uh, it's absolutely fantastic, beautiful place. Um, so yeah, as I say I'll keep the ISO quite low, uh, keep the clarity um, um, and I'm probably going to be about uh, f11, f16 um, and just uh, play with the, the shutter speed to get a, good, uh, a nice clear, um, clear shot. So let me just turn the camera around and I'll show you exactly what it's like here. So you can probably see that, um, there you go. Sorry for the shaky lens, um, but that's the sort of thing that you get here. It's um, sometimes it's very dark, as uh, you can see, the shadows are really standing out be because of the wet leaves and uh, against the the bright green where the water's kind of uh, um, glimmering on the leaves and making them shine a bit more. Um, I haven't got a um, any filters, any ND filters or anything with me, um, so I'm just going to have to make do with what I've got. Um, but to be honest with you, I'll just keep the uh, keep the exposure slightly lower, and then uh, um, we should be we should be good to go. So I'm going to carry on taking photographs, and uh, I'll show you what they look like um, at the end. 